Fireworks in the play. Mini Wargamer Dave here from MiniWarGaming.com. Welcome Wargamers to another DVD release. This time it is our goal to teach you how to highlight everything. In this two DVD release, we have shown you how to highlight many different aspects of your miniatures. These DVDs are unique because they are based off of the comments that you have left. Just take a look at what I'm talking about here. Epic LOL says, I find the flat areas of the Space Marine shoulder pads quite annoying to highlight. And so what does Chris do? He shows you exactly how to highlight the shoulder pads of a Space Marine. This might sound like a really simple concept, but when you're the recipient or the person who asked the question and you got the answer for it, it makes you a little bit happy to know that your voice is being heard. And I'm sure many of you have the same question. Speaking of a problem that a lot of you might have in common, perhaps some of you also have this problem. Straggler says, The biggest problem I've got is making my highlighting look somewhat blended into the other surface. Generally, whenever I try to highlight something like armor or a cape, there's a pretty hard line transition from the darker parts to the lighter parts. Lucky for you all, Chris is the master at this. In fact, I think he's addicted to this. He does this type of blending and highlighting even when it's not necessary. Even when he's given other instructions, he somehow reverts back to this method. And so you, sir, have asked the right question. And for anyone else who also has this concern or problem or question, you've definitely hit the jackpot. Let's try source lighting highlights. He demonstrates a cool glow effect here, coming off of the skull and skeletal hands, which reflect onto the cloak. Object source lighting definitely falls under the category of highlighting. And since it is our goal to show you how to highlight everything, we had to include it. Even highlighted metallic and gold and gunmetal. We go over this too. Chris, with his flawless brush, demonstrates this effect on this gun that he paints gold, as well as this gun that he paints silver. Now, I should probably talk to Chris about creating a brush line called Flawless. And then, of course, he would argue it's not the brush, it's the painter. But I think we all know that it's the way of the brush. Now, get this, you're gonna like this one. More realistic painting, like edge highlighting, but it'd be cool to see some tutorials where you show how to get a more realistic look as opposed to the cartoony look GW does. He demonstrates this effect using a Xlanthos model. I think he had it sitting on his desk and he just wanted an excuse to use the model. Let's talk about the second DVD here. There's a big controversy here with this one, especially since I'm the one announcing it, and it doesn't make sense, I know. But, seeing as that the Tau is a relatively new army, a lot of people want to know how to paint their Tau models. And what better to show a multitude of techniques than to demonstrate these effects on a Tau Barracuda flyer. Chris covers everything on this model. And I think he only got away with it because I just found out it was a Tau model after he did all the painting techniques on it. He shows you nice blending techniques using turquoise. And not only does he show the technique, he explains it really well with his huggable bear-like voice that you've just got to listen to. If you know what I mean there. <laughs> I don't know if that was terribly clear, but... Anyway, yeah, it was kind of a choice whether or not that highlight should run that whole length backwards like that. And he shows you metallics on the flyer. It's one thing to paint the model really well, but when the metallics don't match the look of the model, then it just looks off. Chris shows you really well how to do this. Then moving on to the infamous Tau ochre color, with all the associated blending techniques that he uses for this as a nice additive to this Tau flyer. He shows you how to paint black, and not just black, but blending in the turquoise into the black, to give it that moving through space really quickly look. There's probably a proper term for that, but I think that describes it pretty well. Chris shows you how to properly control your brush in order to achieve this effect. Let's not forget about the intakes, because there's a particular technique that he shows you and how to do this and make it look well. Then moving on to the details of the model, he really enjoyed painting these gem-like features, seeing that he collects Eldar. In fact, I think in the video he called them gemstones. Probably not gemstones, but he painted them similarly to those. And finally, adding your decals. Because believe it or not, there's a right way to do this and some people mess it up. And there, ladies and gentlemen, is your Tau Flyer, your second DVD in the Highlight Everything DVD series. There was so much information packed into this second DVD that it had to be made into a second DVD. It was originally gonna be part of the first one, but there was just too much on it that it needed to be autonomous from the first one. And there was a lot of information in the first one as well. So this is what you guys get. Click on the link below, get your free digital downloads of these Highlight Everything DVDs. By doing so, you will be signing up to a one-week free trial to the Mini Wargaming Vault. You will need PayPal or a credit card to do so. After that seven-day trial, you will be billed monthly. If you choose to cancel after that time, you can do so. There's a 30-day money-back guarantee, so if you forget to ask for your money back, you'll get it no problem. But we definitely encourage you to stay, because there are a lot more videos coming, a lot more painting video tutorials, battle reports, behind the scenes, and everything that you love about the videos that you watch at Mini Wargaming. Because half of the content 
actually I think at this point it's even more than half, but a lot of it are in the vault. Half of them are in the vault. This is what runs this place now, and it is our goal to bring you more polished, more entertaining, more better videos. But seriously, if you've ever contemplated getting a vault membership, this is definitely the DVD to do so. Click on the link below, get your free digital downloads of these two DVDs, and watch the talent flow as Chris demonstrates all these techniques. See you in the next video.